Hello, it's Kenny Evans here in another car video. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So the topic of this video is women aren't more attractive because they're young. Uh, but before I get into this topic, I want to let you guys know uh, this channel is for both men and women to be the best they can be in all aspects of their lives. Sure, the dating and relationships, the health, the wealth, and the mindset, all very crucial to helping you guys be the best versions of yourself. Now we got that out of the way. Hey, I want to thank all the new people who are here. Welcome. I want to uh, thank and welcome all the people who have been here for a while. Welcome. And if you haven't done so, subscribe and hit that notification button so you'll be notified for whenever I upload some new videos. And if you just want to support me or if you like my videos, hit that thumbs up button. It really helps the algorithm. So thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, let's get back into the topic at hand. Women aren't more attractive because they are young. And when I mean attractive, I'm not just talking about physically attractive. I'm also talking about more personality attractive, overall attractive, not just how they look. So um, a lot of guys, the whole red pill community is pretty much talking about younger women. They're, 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 I don't want to say disdain, but their um, anger towards younger women, how younger women treat them. They don't really care too much about older women or the women who've hit the wall. I've done a video about that too, you know, about the truth about women hitting the wall. So um, they get that misconception that younger women are more attractive and all this stuff. But you would think about all the drama that they talk about with the younger women, that they would be afraid of getting with younger women, ironically. So I'm going to get into some reasons, four reasons that uh, women aren't more attractive because they're young. And one very special reason that uh, you guys should get with a young woman. And I believe it's the only real reason. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Let us get into this. Reason number one. Women aren't more attractive because they're young. Because some younger women don't take care of themselves. We've all seen it. Those those women in high school, when we were in high school, who are fat, who are just not that attractive, that really a lot of guys didn't like. You know, compared to some older women who are just more attractive, it's just, it's night and day. You know what I mean? Not all younger women are attractive. You got some overweight, some just don't look good. They don't even work out. They just, you know, they're just miserable, smoking, doing drugs. Like, all that counts. You know, but all you hear is, oh, get you a younger woman. And woo, 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 woo. You know, and I get it. Younger women do have some perks do but just because they're young doesn't mean they're more attractive you know what i mean and not all of them take care of themselves look at the the world we are in right now look at the younger people specifically the women not all of them look good a lot of them do some of them do i don't know the percentage but not all of them do not all of them take care of themselves first reason second reason you know um when it comes to all that Younger women have less experience and can be molded if you're the right kind of guy. But the key to that reason is if you are the right kind of guy. That's very important because most guys are not the right kind of guy. Most guys are weak men. And that's just by nature. Most men are going to be weak. And therefore, most women are going to be weak. So even if you're in the opportunity to, you know, mold this woman, you have to be able to, you know, but most men won't because they just aren't strong enough for it. And that's just the, the reality of the situation. And in fact, they'll let the woman run them and mold them. 
you know, so it's very important, you know, that you understand women, younger women lack the experience and can be molded, but you have to be the guy who can mold them, be that right kind of guy, you have to, or else you will be molded, you know, so that's the second reason, third reason, Younger women can be fickle because of the attention they get. Whether it's coming to set a date or, you know, setting plans or meeting up or just really them focusing on you, returning their, your calls or texts. They could be fickle because they get a lot of attention. You may be the, 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 the cool guy that they like Friday evening. Saturday evening, they got somebody else who they like more. You know, they may be texting you all, all week. And then again, maybe Friday evening, they meet somebody else and then there's no more text. You know, younger women are not consistent most of the time. You know what I mean? They could be very fickle and that is something you got to be aware of. You know, a lot of guys nowadays aren't willing to deal with that. You know, a woman, a younger woman may, you know, stop texting you for maybe a, a week or two, maybe even longer, and then come back to you. Maybe she started dating somebody. Maybe she started seeing somebody, you know, and all of a sudden she she dropped off the face of the earth, but then now she came back. You know, a lot of guys might not be able to handle that, or not even might, they won't be able to handle that, you know. Especially if it's a girl that they really liked and they were put all their eggs in that basket with her and then she disappears. They don't want to be needy and blow up her phone. So they let her go. But they think it's them. When in reality, it's she had somebody else who she just happened to like more at that moment. And then all of a sudden she comes back. You know, so it is it's very it's very important that you understand that. Younger women can be very fickle. You know, so. Ooh -wee. But yes, if you are still here, I do appreciate you still being here. And I will ask that you uh, subscribe and hit that notification button so you'll be notified for whenever I upload some new videos. And of course, if you want to support me, or if you like my videos, hit that like button as well. Thank you. So, uh, fourth reason here. Older women who take care of themselves also have experience and look good. The best of both worlds. Older women generally know what they want and know what they don't want. And if you fit what they are looking for, you're in. But then the key is if they take care of themselves, they could look just like younger women or close. They look incredible got the body skin looking right and i get it you got you know surgeries and medicines and shots and pills and i get it and all these procedures but at the same time they will still look good and that's what you want i mean depending on what you're looking for that's what you want an older woman who takes care of themselves because you know their mind is going to be pretty steady and they still gonna be looking like they could, you know, let's say she's forty, she could be looking like she's in her, her in her twenties, you know, or in her thirties. She's gonna be looking good. That's the bottom line. So yes, 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 I got you a bonus. Your bonus, bonus reason here. You know, and it's kind of a little bit off topic, but like I said, it's gonna be the reason you should. Uh, actually go with the younger woman and that's the only real reason I say and the younger women are best for relationships and children and like I mentioned before younger women can be molded and because they have less experience but they can be molded by the right kind of guy that means you have to be the right kind of guy and that's where the pressure comes in you know, as a strong man, you are the right kind of guy. You're constantly getting better, constantly learning, only surrounding yourself with people who, you know, add value to your life and you want to be around. 
you know, constantly being the positive guy, you know, and checking people who, who need to be checked. You know what I mean? Being the best chef of your life, looking the best you can, you know, making as much money as you can, doing what you want in your life, pretty much running your life as you want. You know, so getting in a relationship with that woman who doesn't have a lot of experience and can be molded, you can make her into your ideal woman. Change her mindset. Teach her some things. Help her grow as a person. You know, and of course, if you want children, you know, younger women are more fertile, generally speaking, than older women. So um, being able to get a, a younger woman is, is ideal for that if you want to have kids. You know, having healthy kids, but also, again, uh, being able to mold them into the type of woman who you want them to be in a relationship for you is crucial. And those are really the only reason you should um, get with a younger woman. So uh, that's all I got for y'all. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button so you'll be notified whenever I upload some new videos. Uh, let me know what uh, you think I missed, or if you don't think I missed everything, let me know if you like my my, my list, or if you don't. Um, of course, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. Again, whether it's the dating relationship, health, wealth, or mindset, it doesn't matter. Just let me know. And if you found value in this video, I appreciate donations. Any little bit counts. Thank you in advance. And uh, yeah, I hope y'all are safe. And I hope I see y'all uh, next week as well. And always remember, the strongest man is the happiest man.